Hello everyone, welcome to Story and Montessori. I'm here today with one fun book by Usborn First Experience. The name of the book is Going to School. This book is written and illustrated by Anne Sivardi and Stephen Cartwright. There is a little yellow duck hiding on every double page. Can you find it? This is the Peach family. This is Mrs. Peach, Mr. Peach, Polly Peach, Percy Peach. They have Pong the kitten, Ping the other kitten, Dusty the cat, and one more pet called Sydney the gerbil. Percy and Polly are twins. Tomorrow they are going to school for the first time. This is where the peaches live. They live above the Marsh family. Millie Marsh is going to the same school as the twins. Can you see? Millie Marsh is saying hi to Polly and Percy. Mr. and Mrs. Peach wake Percy and Polly. It's 8 o'clock in the morning. It's time for them to get ready for school. Percy and Polly get up and get dressed. They have their breakfast. Then the twins put on their shoes and coats. Millie is ready to go to school with them. Can you see Millie standing at the door? And yes, can you see the little ducky hiding behind the shoes? They all go to school. At first, Polly is a little shy. Mrs. Todd, the teacher, says that Mrs. Peach, who is Polly's mother, can stay with her for a while. Mr. Peach hangs Percy's coat on his own special hook. He has to take Percy's pet, Gerbil, Sydney, back home with him. Percy and Polly join their class. There are lots of things to do at school such as painting, drawing, reading and dressing up. Some children make things out of paper and others make things with clay. What are Percy and Polly doing? Can you spot them? They have fun making things. Two of the teachers help them making tiny washing lines full of clothes to take home. Can you see? Washing line with clothes. It is time for singing. Miss Dot, the music teacher, teaches them lots of songs. She also teaches them how to play lots of instruments. Now it's time for a break. It's 11 o'clock. Everyone has a drink and something to eat. Percy and Polly are both very thirsty. Can you see them enjoying their chocolate milk? It's story time. Mrs. Todd tells the children a story about a big tiger named Stripes. What is Percy up to now? The children go out to the playground. There are lots of things to play with outside. There are tractors and hoops and bicycles and balls. Polly loves going down the slide. Percy likes to play in the sand. But Millie has found something else to play with. Can you spot her? It's time for Percy and Polly to go home. They have had a happy day at school and so has Millie. They have made lots of new friends. I hope you enjoyed reading this book along with me. Just like Polly and Percy enjoyed going to school. See you again at Story and Montessori. Bye-bye.